change user privilege. When you first add a user to the lock system, you must specify their privilege. It's possible at a later stage, if required, to go in and change the privilege of that user. Both the master and the manager have the ability to do this, and this time I'll use the master code. So with the master code, we can immediately just enter the master ID of 00, followed by the master code, and then scroll down so that users is highlighted, press enter, scroll down so that edit is highlighted, press enter, and we want to edit user ID 3. I want to give this user the privilege to override time delay. So they've already got the privilege to open the lock. They don't have audit privilege, but we'll just go in and check that. You can see they don't have that privilege. Uh, and now I want to give them the privilege to override time delay. So I'll press enter and then I'll press one to give them the privilege. If I press one here, it takes away the privilege. So press one again, because I want them to have this ability. Press enter and then scroll down to update user, press enter, and now that user has been updated to have the ability to override time delay.